Hello. Happy Sunday. I'm going to do some Sega Genesis stuff. This is a weird rental game that I remember playing a long, long time ago. It's called Bubble and Squeak. And you know what? I haven't played this game in roughly 20 years. So it's going to be a miracle if I even remember how to play it. Ah, oh, my, my controllers are becoming a tangled nightmare once more. It never takes long, either. It never takes long. I may have just made it worse. That's cool. It's, it's woven in the most intricate bullshit pattern possible. I'm trying my best to thread the needle here. Here we go. All my cables are black. My bedroom is pitch black right now, so it's it's a good time trying to feel around. Also, it's it is hot as snot outside. It was 30 degrees one night a few days ago, and now it's close to 80. W what's happening? <laughs> am I alive? Am I living? Am I dead? I'm not sure. But I know I'm live in terms of the stream. I weirded that strangely. Anyways, bubble and squeak. Bubble and squeak. Am I alive? Am I death? This is the heartwarming story about a boy and his weird bipedal blue monkey thing that chews gum. Shoot, jump, jump, and freeze. Okay. This should be good. It's been 20 years. This should be just fine. I expect to drown a lot. I remember drowning quite frequently in this game. All right, we're off to a good start. So you shoot these little stars. And I remember at one point the water level did start rising, which freaked me out as a kid. I don't know if that's this level, though. Oh, the jump is so weird and floaty. And I just got a spaceship thing. Is that for him in the water? Nah. Nah, we don't need that. Yeah, I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> My buddy should be around here somewhere. Where is he? You're supposed to have two characters you play with. And you know what? I couldn't tell you who is Bubble and who is Squeak. Time has not been fair to my memory. Although I do have an instruction manual we could delve into at some point. Hey, there he is. Come on. Uh, do the thing where you throw me. Oh. Here. How do I make you- there you go. There we are. Oh! Okay. Blech. Yeah, he, have, he has like strands of skin on his head. It's creepy. I think that was the little penguin with the baseball bat quacking. I mean, the music's okay. I very distinctly remember this song because it's one of the only ones I heard because I never could get very far in this game. Whoa! 
Holy shit. How did I do that? Can I do it again? Oh god. <laughs> Wait, come here. Oh. He's so slow, come on. Come on, little fella. Oh, it's a little monkey fella. Eh, it's a little monkey fella. Oh. We, we may have a problem here. Come on. You can do it, I believe. He can't go that way. He can't jump high enough. Uh. Fuck. I have an idea. He's gonna drown if I do this. Hold on. Stay. Oh, this is gonna take some figuring out, isn't it? Here, come here. Uh-oh, he's gonna drown. Do you hear that? Oh, look at this, I'm stuck too. Oh, alright. There you go. I didn't even know where he was. So yeah, pro tip, don't launch him off the edge. Or else you might end up losing him. This was one of those weird rental games that was just so weird and out there. It was one of the ones that I was able to rent in a small farming town in Virginia. Let that sink in for a moment. That store didn't have many games, but this was one of them. Yeah, you automatically fail if, uh... I'm looking this up right now. I need to know which one's which. Squeak is the blue creature, Bubble is the boy. Okay. Oh, there's a story here. Hold on. Bubble was just about to fall asleep when he heard a thump and a strange squeaking noise coming from the wardrobe. Summoning all his courage, he got out of bed and opened the wardrobe door to reveal a strange blue creature sitting amongst his dirty socks. Who are you? he asked, trying to sound braver than he felt. I'm Squeak, replied the blue creature nervously. Where am I? You're in my wardrobe, said Bubble, and I want to know how you got there. Well, said the creature, the last thing I remember is jumping into a passing black hole, hoping to find someone who could help us. Us, interrupted Bubble. You mean there are more of you in there? No, they're all working in the porridge mines on Gruel. What? I'm the only one who escaped, and you're the only one who can help. A large tear rolled slowly down his cheek. Porridge, Gruel, perhaps if you started from the beginning I'd know what's going on, said Bubble. But of course, I'll help you if I can. So Squeak explained how the evil Cat of Ninetales and his henchmen had captured the inhabitants of Gruul, imprisoning them in Bozo Domes and forcing them to work in the porridge mines. Somehow Squeak had evaded capture and had used this last few coins to buy some bubble gum. There must have been something special about the gum because as he chewed it he suddenly felt full of energy and jumped into a passing black hole? <laughs> okay, said Bubble. I'll help you. But how do we get to Gruel? Well, I'm not sure. I think we'll have to jump into a black hole. Will any black hole do? asked Bubble. How about that one in my sock? It looks pretty black to me, said Squeak. Let's try it. And so now you know how Bubble and Squeak came to find themselves on the planet Gruel. But that's only the beginning. Now you've got to outwit the evil cat of nine tails, free the creatures trapped in Bozo Domes, and live happily ever after. What are you waiting for? That's literally the last line in the thing. Wow, that was a journey. <laughs> oh my god. Amazing.
Well, and we might as well look up the controls while we're here. So if you pick up the submarine icon and finish a level, you will battle against Cat of Nine Tails in a shoot 'em up. And you must complete one before you go on to the next. There's five in total. In addition, if you get if you free three of Squeak's little monster friends from the Bozo Domes, you get to play a bonus game. In all, there are ten different bonus games. There is a Bozo Dome on most, but not all of the main levels. If it wasn't already tricky enough, you'll find that most of the main levels gradually flood with water. While Bubbles and Squeak can survive underwater for a short time, you shouldn't push your luck. Oh yeah, well I definitely remember the fucking water now. Um, also, this is interesting. This is a manual from the CD32. Uh, I'm assuming Turbo Graphics CD32? I don't, I don't exactly know what that is. Or Amiga. You can use a CD32 controller. Is it, or Actually, CD32 might be a PC home system. Holy shit. This is crazy. This must have been like a European game that they released in America for Genesis. Oh man. This Amiga CD32 controller. Look at this horrific thing. Hold on, let me show you guys. Oh, this thing is hideous. This. Wait. Here, I'll let you look at the controls too. Does that look like a comfortable controller to you? What in God's name? <laughs> Oh. Uh, wow. Well, this doesn't exactly help me in terms of uh, Sega Genesis controls. I don't even remember the rental game having a manual either. Let's see. I was looking for this earlier, but I couldn't really come up with anything. Only people selling the damn thing, which doesn't help. Oh, hold on. Wait a minute. Nope! It's another website selling the damn thing. Come on. Are you kidding me? Alright, here we go. Bubble and Squeak. Manual. Yeah! Oh, it's just the art for the manual. Which is also equally as terrifying. Makes the kid look like an absolute asshole. Plus, his eyebrows are like part of his head. That's that's terrifying. He looks like Elmer Fudd with like a severe burn going on. It's like his skin is being flayed from his body. It's terrifying. Um. Okay. Well. Wow. There's literally nothing. This might be one of the rarest game manuals to find anywhere. Alright, well, fuck it. I give up. Yeah, Bubble does look like a bootleg Bart Simpson. Okay, I guess I'll look at the manual real quick here. You could probably figure it out from the Amiga controls. Uh, let's see. This is a very short manual, actually. Um, action button can call, stop, squeak, pick up an object, climb off of squeak, and insert coins. Hopefully not into squeak. <laughs> look up, look down. Plus fire, plus kick, equals restart level. Apparently there's a shortcut to restart the level, which includes pressing the look up and look down buttons at the same time. They have their own designated buttons on the CD32 controller, but I don't know how the hell you would do that on Genesis. So maybe that's just... It's just a, uh, it's an Amiga thing. 
All right, well, we'll just have to futz about with it until we get it right. So I give up. I'm not gonna read that anymore. Let's keep playing. Okay, I'm not gonna let Bubble go the wrong way this time. Whee! Can I just, like, shoot him up? That'd be cool. Okay, so don't hit the penguin from the front. That's the lesson here. <sighs> Let me go. I just want to know if I can shoot him up. No. It's not happening. He just wants to toss me. That's it. Alright. Yeah, you can look up and down. Here, you wait here. I don't trust you not to get yourself killed. How the hell do you get that? You know, it's it's really not important. Also, Squeak apparently doesn't have to worry about enemies. I'm very lucky that water is not rising here. This definitely does look like an Amiga game. It just has that graphic quality. That translates well over to the Genesis. Alright, I made it. <laughs> and then they shake hands! That's great. Here comes the shoot 'em up, apparently. That's pretty funky music. So every every button is shoot. I don't know if I'm allowed to touch the walls, but uh I'm not gonna risk it. This is actually a pretty good tune. I've always been very terrible at these types of games. So, expect me to hit a wall at some point. Or a fish. A fish. Oh, hey, Johnny. Oh, hi, Johnny. Wow, I get to start- I have the privilege of starting over at the beginning. Aren't I- aren't I just the luckiest? So I can- I can rub against walls, but I can't get crushed by them. Also, Johnny, we're gonna watch Cabin in the Woods on Tuesday. Um... Do you wanna- do you wanna watch with us, or are you gonna be out that night? And when I say us, I, I literally mean Kazi, Mick, myself, and whoever else decides to join us. Uh, 
Uh, it's gonna be at 10 o'clock. I can't remember if you go out earlier or if you go out later. You work till 8. Yeah. We're gonna do it late on Tuesdays for the foreseeable future just so that people on the West Coast have a better chance of getting in. I'm gonna go up here this time. Eighty-five percent likely. Well, that's that's good chances. I like those odds. Also, I just got something. I don't know what it was though. Uh. Fuck. Oh, oh, it's a checkpoint. Wait, how many how many chances do I get to do this? I, I don't know. I don't have, like, a live counter or anything. God, what an obnoxious pair of enemies. Just blocking the road entirely. Eesh. Oh, my thumb hurts. <laughs> There's no auto fire. That's that's me jamming on the button. How long is this? And there's five of these. Five shoot 'em up bonus stages. Oh my goodness. <gasps> Fuck. I for some reason I thought I could go through the tops. Oh look at look at Squeak looking around. Whoa, 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 whoa! That is definitely a cat. They did not false advertise this. Yeah, fuck you. Okay, I guess I did it. <laughs> oh, okay. Was it much of a fanfare. Did you hear that sound that the cupcake made when I ate it? It was like... Pfft. That was weird. Let's stay. We must do puzzles. No, 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 no. Wow, I get, like, no time. I don't want to fall. Alright. Um, I have I don't even have commentary for this. You you're getting what you're seeing here. You are getting exactly what you're seeing. Ah, oh, fuck off, bubble. Or squeak. God damn it. Stay. Stay. Oh no. I hope the water isn't rising. That would really put a toothpick in my labia. Now I remember the point of kicking him around. It's because of these things. Don't twiddle your thumbs. Get on this thing and stay. Stay. Even though it was my fault the first time. Stay. Good. This is how friendships are formed. Alright. Let's 
try this. There you go. That's how you get him up some places. And there he goes. There we are. Shake on it. More shoot? You get to do more shoot? The Raspberry Lagoon. Ooh, it's red this time. <clears throat> cool, it's the same enemies. I'm a fan already. Oh god, Robofish. Oh my god, they just like disintegrated. They had like pieces of their face. Jesus Christ. How horrifying. Alright, this is where the water starts to rise. Oh, okay. Fuck you. Okay, I gotta hurry. My reaction time is pretty pitiful. What? What? Did it hit me? Oh. Okay. I don't expect us to get very far, but the game is relatively quick, so... If I need to, I'll just play through it again real fast. You motherfucking snakes! Like, slow down. Totally fair enemy. Okay, this music is actually pretty good. <laughs> Very catchy. It's got that great Genesis sound to it. Really? Okay. Never mind. That was cool. Oh, oh, why did I do that? Is the water rising yet? Not yet. It will, though. It will. I dread that time when it arrives. Oh, right. Um... Uh... You, uh... Did you get your gum yet? Oh, there we go. Yep. This is happening. I have no idea what this power-up does. Just shoot. You shoot Babu. And I missed that somehow. So... I want to know what this is. I have no idea what this is. I don't know if it does anything. Oh, wait a minute. That's probably one of those capture pods, isn't it? Hold on, this is a job for the manual. Um... 
Bozo Dome. Yeah, how do you break them? Trying to find any relevant information for this game is a true challenge. Okay, well, I don't know. Couldn't find it. <sighs> this game's got nothing. Or this, uh, the internet has nothing. Pick up! Pick up the coins! You motherfucker. He just ran off! Come on. game. Oh, apparently I can jump on enemies with this guy. There you go. I kind of prefer that to the traditional shoot. Um... I thought the bub the monkey would be bubble too, but apparently he's squeak. So there you go. There we are. I am an idiot. What if I could just jump on enemies with bubble? Nope. That ain't happening. It's a useless twat that follows you around unless he has bubblegum. He just like assumes the position. It's like, alright, I've received my payment. You may enter when ready. Convenient. Look at this little <laughs> this little penguin fella riding on a bug. Little cowboy. Oh god. <gasps> I'm just gonna go explore the level on my own, don't mind me. God, look, there's even more down there. Oh my god! <laughs> so much stuff! Again, that weird crushing, crumbling noise when I eat the 
the uh, cupcake. Is there more? No, there's not. Oh, the water's coming, though. Ruh-ro. Squeak! We gotta go! But not without collecting more bonus items. You stupid monkey. Now look, you're gonna die. Okay, never mind. You're fine. But, uh, we gotta... <laughs> we really gotta hurry now. Please. Oh, squeak, don't die. Okay, there we go. That was close. But. But. What was that about? You stopped before. There. I think I have to be standing there to catch him. Also, I would love to know how to break this pod. Here, give me up there. Right there. What? Oh? Okay. Well, he's off drowning now, so he's fine. Yeah. Teamwork! So you gotta feed the thing crystals, and then it busts open. Oh, here comes the shoot. Here comes the shoot! Okay, let's try not to disintegrate ourselves this time. How much do you want to bet that this this game is going to have like some sort of horrible eldritch abomination level by the end of the game? This seems like the kind of game that would. It's going to end up looking like the alien level in Contra. Okay, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Hooray! You fucker! That is some horseshit right there. Ah, oh. damn it! I'd buy that for a dollar. Water's coming already. Uh. 
Oh, it just puts you here? <laughs> Alright. Yeah, throw me into the enemy. Good. Come on. Hurry up. How the heck am I even going to find enough of these before the end of the level? And before the water rises? It's like, see, look, it's all down there. Alright then. I guess I gotta really bust ass. Oh, um, somebody give Johnny the uh, rabbit link, so he can have it for Tuesday night. It's the website we'll be using to uh, stream the movie. something at me. I couldn't even see it. Good. I just fell all the way back down. There's still the business, uh, business of that little pod. Can I get to it in time? Sources say no. Well, maybe. Really? I don't have enough? I'll see you, Johnny. Have a good night. Fuck. Ah, uh, well, I'm fucked. Oh, surprisingly not fucked. Hmm. I don't know. We're not freeing those critters, though. That one's just gonna drown. <laughs> Too bad. So sad. I missed the submarine, wherever it was. This is one of those games that you have to replay a lot to, like, learn the level layout. So you can get everything. Oh. Oh. Okay. That was weird. Oh, 
Uh, no, this is not in the Steam collection. It'd be nice if it was. It's just a really weird, obscure game that I rented as a kid. Hmm. I'm trying to <laughs> get him to bounce around. No. I see what I'm supposed to do. Duh. There. Oh my god. He just got a bunch of stuff. Uh, I don't know where he landed. That sounded like an earthbound sound. Yeah, taking out my frustration slightly by repeated kicks to the face, or to the dick, to a yuck. Uh. Oh, there he is! Well, alright. <laughs> he just wound up over here. That's fine. What? That looked like a thing he could- Oh, I can pick this up? Really? the end of the level. Well, I, I don't even know how I would get over there. Maybe with the spring. Assuming the water hasn't completely come up yet. It's getting there. Uh. You gotta pay a lot of money to free these little bastards. Alright, come on. Shake my hand. Nice password. The password mostly consisted of the letter H. Oh, that's interesting. It actually starts us off at the checkpoint when we come back. I like that. It's clever. So it is kind of meant to be a marathon shoot 'em up that you play throughout the whole game. better than the damn Izzy rocket things. Maybe want to tear my hair out half the time. Because they were so long. No time to, no time to waste. We gotta get in here. Alright. Get that checkpoint, baby. Uh oh. Oh god, the fish is making a second pass. Oh!
you bastard. I got inked. Also, the, the pacing of the levels is very strange. Like, I did the Crystal Caverns, like three of them, then I did one of the Neverglades levels, and then I went back to here. I'm, I'm, oh, that's confusing. Snake! It's fine, I got it. Ah, fucking snake. This game is kind of morbid. Uh, uh oh. I have, I have locked myself away from Squeak. There's the exit. I need to get him down to the gumball machine. Where the fuck is he? Oh, he's over here. How am I gonna get over there? Seriously, though. Huh. I'm trying to activate him, but he's not coming. Well. Um. Can't pass through platforms. I tried that. Oh, this is good. Oh, wait a minute. There we are. There we are. Alright, we need to get you some gum. See, look how excited he is. Like this level right here, it wasn't even that difficult. So what the... Oh. Okay, don't move. Don't move. There. I didn't want him falling off. Alright, back to shoot. I do kind of like the change in pace, where like, you're doing escort... Whoa. Hold on, this is different. Hold that thought. Oh my god. This music is panic inducing. Oh. Okay. <clears throat> the Diamond Foundry. Oh my god. Just to just to clarify, I have never seen this far into the game. This is all new for me. Because I was a dumb kid and I didn't understand the puzzle mechanics when I was younger. Oh, that water is coming really fast. Can I have a lava bath? Oh, it pushed the water back down. Okay. Um. <laughs> Where the fuck did he go? I lost Squeak! Oh no. I lost Squeak. <laughs> this could be a tricky jump, isn't it? Oh, alright. I underestimated how far he could jump.
Oh, this is the most Sega Genesis y music I've ever heard. Oh, there he is! What were you doing? Having yourself a little jog? It's a whole different kind of stress. Last night was stress from not having any ink ribbons and having lots of claw feature creatures features. This is just drowning the game. All right, critter rescued. I can't help but rock out to this music a little bit. I wasn't going to squeeze through. Oh god. What?! Ah! I ran into that. Entirely on my own. You... Come here. No, I don't want you to mess with the gum machine right now. I want you to sit here. No. Stop. Stay. Why, why do you not obey me? I just want that. Oh. Oh, God. Come here. S stay. Fine. Be a dick about it. Here, I have another way to get it. Cool, I got shot. Oh, it's like a trampoline. Oh yeah. Did you hear that? Did you hear the Genesis slowing down for just a second there? There's so many gems on the screen. The game doesn't know what to do. Oh, that's great. I love that. Blast processing, everybody. I don't think the level or the water is gonna rise here. That would be kind of cruel. Oh. 
Um. So. Okay. Hmm. I do have the luxury of time on my side this time. So, um. I need three coins, but. Someone's holding out on me. Unless I missed a coin from an enemy? Pretty sure the coins don't disappear. Since they're pretty much required to solve the puzzles. What the fuck? I guess I could try feeding two coins to the machine and see what it does. Oh! Guess what? The water's rising. <laughs> We're gonna die! Nope! Not enough water. Well, it was nice knowing you, Squeak. Have fun. See, at least I lived. That's the important part. Okay. Let's try again. Do I gotta put a spring link on his head? No. There's no way. Just one coin. Your gumballs can't save you now. Oh, there's that slowdown again. I, I literally don't know. I have no idea. Is... you know... hold on. This is a stupid idea, but it might do something. Yeah, Squeak, you can follow me if you want to, it's alright. Really? What? Oh, okay. That's how that works, apparently. Anybody else's brain broken yet? Well, now I have to go get the other spring. Hi, Macau. Oh, well, we're fucked anyways. Well, Squeak is. I'm not. Goodbye, Squeak. Wow, you actually have to bring down all three springs. And then stack them on top of each other! Okay, that's fine. Sure. I'm sure any child would have thought to do the same. The age that I was when I first played this. And never got this far because I always got stuck. Oh yeah! 
Well, I'm gonna die if I fall down there. You motherfucker. Well, we got one continue. And then we're starting all over again! Oh, did anybody happen to get the passwords? <laughs> I, uh, I haven't been writing those down, admittedly. I will serenade you with Genesis Slowdown. Oh fuck. You did get a clip of this level's password? Okay. Um if we if we game over again, we can just put it in the chat. Fuck! I meant to get that spring first. The water's gonna start coming in it. Now I'm like terrified of the water. It's okay, we just have to beat this, and then we can get the next level's password, and then we're good. Absolutely, springs work like this. What, you've never used springs before? Oh my god. Please, get me up there. Okay, I just need one coin. Quickly. Look at these platforms. Could this be any more obnoxious? Here. I'll even rescue this thing while I'm at it. Even though I should probably get back down there and rescue him. Come on. Hurry up. You're free. You're free! We. Okay, let's go. Wait. Wait, 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 before we do that. Alright. Fuck. Fuck! I fucked it up. Oh no. Guys, I need that spring on top of this one. In order for me to do that, I have to hop off of Squeak. That's it, we're fucked. No, you don't get another piece of gum, you dipshit. We're, we're out of coins. We're broke. We're fucking penniless now. It's over. You're going to drown. <laughs> That's it. It's over, Squeak. Ah, uh, God damn it. Okay. First and foremost. There. Get that first. Well, I missed a cupcake. Oh, you could throw it. There we go. Yeah, that works. Saves me some time. Oh, look at that! Just cheaped it out. Cheap, 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 cheap. What's the matter, Bumble? You chicken? Cheep, 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 cheep.
Yeah, now we're talking. That was a doozy. Alright, who wants to be on password duty? I think you have time to write it down before I uh, continue. <sighs> Good stretch. Face <sighs> word. Don't just tell me when you got it. All right, I got it. Mm, boogie. Oh yes, boogie. Stuck on the ceiling. Oh my god. Really? No gum for you, Squeak. Not yet. We got things to do. Okay? Why won't you jump on the pot? Hey, come here. There you go. See, that wasn't so bad. Do I even have enough? Whew, just barely. Oh, I know, I love the music slowdown. It's so good. I don't really need all the rest of this crap. I can just move on. <laughs> Maybe an extra life or two up there, but I really don't care. I got the sub. I got the critter. All I need to do is, I guess, feed him gum. Oh. Perhaps I am not finished here yet. Oops. Oops. No! I didn't want to ride you! Now look what you did! You've broken physics, Bum- er, Squeak! Now look what you did! Well, only one thing left to do now. What? There's a ghost, guys. There's a ghost in the house. Bye.
Hmm. I need him up here somehow. I guess I could use this pot to get up here. There. Wait. Nope. This damages the child. Gonna be one of these puzzles, huh? It'd be funny if I could just carry a stack of pots. Oh, I have to do the tedious labor of getting them all over here, don't I? Yep. Water rising yet? Nah, we're good. Did anyone else hear that? Was my cat, like, hacking up something? That was a good sound, Bimmy. I'm sure the audience appreciated that. Uh-oh, here comes the water. Hurry up! As long as we're up here, we're fine. You know what? No, 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 no. You, you stay here. Okay, come on. It was just a disgusting cat noise, that's all it was. My cat likes to do Gollum impressions sometimes. So it says there's different types of bubble gum. All I've seen so far is this blue stuff. So, I don't know. That's it, we're done. Shake on it, pal. He's touching the child. Bonus level two. That was it? Oh. There was a time limit. <laughs> okay. There was a time limit. Good! So that was stupid. Gonna be one of these scenarios again, isn't it? <laughs> Do not touch the child. Who touched the child? Oh wow, look at that. What? Yeah! I think the pot goes in the dirt. Yes, it does. It does go in the dirt. Stick! Cool. Cool place for a coin. I like how I can't snag it out of midair before it falls in. Nah. 
Na. You know what I just realized? I didn't let anybody write down the password for the previous level. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. That's the thing that I did. Yeah, I think I just habitually press the button. So, whoops. Would you kindly fuck off, elephant? Hey, there he is. I was wondering where you were. And guess who forgot to bring their spring with them? Me! Okay. So... Fuck is this gonna work? I can't grab that. Oh. Okay. <clears throat> I like how the music is still continuing. Oh, this was this was from Sunsoft. Hm. Well then. Anyone happen to get a clip of that last password? Otherwise, I'm just gonna put in the, uh, the only one we had. Alright. Boy, this is a tedious password screen. Me thumb hurts! Stretching. Before we get started. I'm like trying to feel the breeze coming, but it's like it's not there. It's non-existent. There is no breeze. Holy Zool. So here's something I'm trying to understand with Overwatch. If you are, let's say, Roadhog, and you have gold for eliminations and objective eliminations, but you don't have a medal for damage at all, <laughs> how does that work? I guess if you get the last hits? Because usually what was happening was, I would hook somebody, and as I was pulling them towards me, my teammates would just, like, chew them apart. So I think that's how that happened.
Also, I'm behind on my YouTube uploads. I need to work on that. I'm just gonna throw this up temporarily. Just in case somebody new popping in knows that we're kind of we're doing a thing here, and then we'll go back to the game. And then they promptly leave. <laughs> That always cracks me up when that happens. Yeah, we did. We came across a player named Hodrog one time, and that pretty much became the recurring joke with Roadhog. Any time, any time I pick him, I unintentionally now call him Hodrog. That that person ruined me. If you're out there, I just want you to know. That I love you. I still love you, but there's a special place in hell for you. You have, like, made me linguistically dyslexic. Wow, that was a challenge to say. Big yeah. Let's we'll say hi to your fans. Any statements, Boogie? I'll just bonk you on the head with the mic, is that okay? <laughs> bonk. Ha <laughs> what a story, Mark. Try again. From the top. I wonder if I get all my continues back. It'd be a crying shame if I didn't. <sighs> yep, we're back here. I need a jar first. What a tedious puzzle. Oh, I didn't even see that little booger. Oops. Wait a minute. I accidentally activated my phone! Okay. Oh, there's a picture of Boogie on my Twitter. If you go to my page, it's like one of the pictures on the left.
Well, that somehow worked out. Slow down. All right, let's get you some gum. That's your thing. That's what he lives for. All right, password time. Oh, not yet. Got to do this first. Oh, we're at the beginning of these. Damn it. All oh, this sucks. I just alternate between the B and C button. I shoot very quick. But it's murder on my thumb, so I think I won't. I would love to know how this game sounds on a CD32 or an Amiga. I wonder if it sounds the same. Because in terms of sound quality, they're, they're very similar for the systems. Yep, this was also on CD32 and Amiga. Apparently, according to the only manual I was able to find. See ya, kitty. See ya, kitty! And guess what I did? I forgot to uh, pause for the password. <laughs> God damn it!
Ah, uh, somebody who can use clips can get it. You guys are good with that sort of thing, I'm not. Sorry! You didn't see a password? Oh, well. Maybe they only give you them after a, a certain number of levels. Okay, I gotta figure this out quick if I'm gonna do it. I probably can just bounce up there. I'm an idiot. I am an idiot. In true Firestock fashion. Get over there. Alright, here comes the water. Ah, I need a spring! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah! Handshake underwater! <laughs> Alright, I'll wait this time, see if there's a password. More, more shoot. It's time for more shoot. I may be one of the very few people that actually played this on a Genesis when it was out. Because it sounds like not a whole lot of people know about this one. Okay then. No password. Going that way. Get you to jump up here, maybe? Nah. He's not having it. No, no gum yet. Hold your horses. <laughs> Alright, well, you just wait there, I guess? No? Oh dear. Oh dear! I've gone into it now, haven't I? Yep. We're dead. We're dead. Was it that hard to include a save battery on a cartridge? Eh, it was just kind of a product of its time. If the game was designed around passwords, then, you know, that tends to be how it goes. Alright, well, goodbye, Squeak. Just accept it, man. Just accept it. I 
I'll see what I have to do now. I gotta be quick, though. I gotta be real quick. that water is not waiting for anything. Yep, look, here it comes already. Oh my god. Please. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Come on, come on, come on, come on. have all my continues, so that's something. Probably won't get whatever good ending there is, but hey, who cares? <laughs> who even cares? Fuck. Hold on. Come here. You know, I don't think I need to throw the jars over to the, uh, mud. Here, I'm gonna have you wait over here by the gumball machine. Alright. Just sit there. Yeah, you just gotta go fast. Get fast! and not miss your jumps like that. I'm guaranteed to hit something on the way over. Can't get that coin. Oof. Made it. Good. There's your password. What's the password? Alright, good. We got it. We got the password. Bonus level! Yeah, everything basically reset upon uh, using a password. That's alright. Wow. You get, like, no time at all. Also, there's, like... Like an invasive cat hair in my mouth that just won't go away. a spring. We're getting frame drops? Are we? Is it good?
Um, you stay here. I need to go grab the spring. Well, he's not going anywhere. I should have probably grabbed that spring. I'm probably stuck now. Well, I'm dead. Goodbye. Actually, you can stay there, it's fine. That. I forgot you can shoot these things a few times. That the water is way down now. Oh boy. Um, need squeak. I really need squeak over here. Oof. Well, mistake number two electric boogaloo. Yep, this, this level is beefed. Just 100% grade A beefed. Yep. I'm fucked. <laughs> Nothing I can do now. Wonder if um the reset level thing works in this version. Yep, it does. It does. Commit Sudoku. Oh my god. Really? Can I even make this jump? No, I can't. I think I fucked it up again. It. I don't even know how I'm going to make this work. Maybe I just need two springs, hopefully? There you go. Yeah, there you go! Get up here. Get on up here. Perfect. I'm gonna grab this just in case. Um, 
Ah, uh, how dare. I have no idea how this is gonna work. I knew it was coming. God damn it. God dang it. Okay. Ready? Go. Um. Where do you end up? Oh, he's he's still going. He is still going. Oh. Squeak no. Squeak. Squeak. <laughs> Squeak. I've lost him to the uh, the endless spinning wheel. Uh oh, he's drowning. He's drowning somewhere. He's gonna die. Uh, okay. Oh boy. I don't even know where I need to go. I guess over there? The lava uh, makes the water level go down. That's why I keep doing it. You can only do it a limited number of times, though, it seems like. And I think you do need the spring to come down here. him like that maybe I can catch him ah oh, piss why you do there much easier than what I was trying to do before oh look platforming hmm He's drowning again. God damn it. Ah, uh, squeak. I wish I knew where to put you. Alright, you know what I'll do? Hold on. Once I get him over here. Whoa. I overshot that a bit. I will go.
go explore the other side of the level. You wait up here where it's safe. I'm gonna go down here. Hmm. I'm gonna take a chance. Well, that was a dumb thing to do. Cause look, now the water's coming. There's another lava thing. Where's the sw ah? The switch was there. Wow, this level sucks. And by it sucks, I mean it's posing some sort of a challenge to me. And that's no good! Because thinky brainy thing not good for puzzles. So I do want to lower the water level. Oh my god, did I really leave him up there stupidly like that? Ugh. Come here. I just thought of something. I don't even know if it'll work. I just need one of these. Squeaky boy. Jump! <sighs> you useless twat. Well, this isn't gonna work. begin here. There's a gumball machine. Oh no. Oh, what have I done? <laughs> oh my god. See the goalpost, it's over there. It's funny that when he's he doesn't have me riding around on him, he can just jump on the mud just fine. 
but the moment I got on his back, he just is like, ah, it burns! It burns! Too much weight? Ah, uh, could be. Ah. Boo! Look at this mess I've made. Uh, oh, it's it just gets worse. No! <laughs> I finally got the jar. I took it to my grave. Oh boy. These pink elephants can suck a dick. They're annoying and they're awful, and I hate them. I tried to count it in my head. Okay, please don't drown. Okay, he's okay for now. I gotta hurry the hell back over there, though. Please don't drown. Please don't drown. Live. 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 Wait, where is he? Where is he? It's okay. I've got this. Just gotta find him now. With my luck, he'll be over by the gumball machine. Or won't, rather. Hey! How about that? Oh my god. What? Well, this is a thing that's happening. Motherfucker can fly- oh! So sad. We're making good progress. I'll try it again, because I feel like we were close. Discount Yoshi. Okay, password time. Oh, look at that! It saves your password from last time. Nice. It's always nice when games do that. Oh, 
Seriously, they just never stop shooting. Fuck these elephants. Six. Six seconds. Oof. That was close. I mean, you gotta be on point with this level. You cannot waste any time. Whoop. Excuse me. Gotta go, go, gadget. Need one more coin. There it is. All right, no one's screwing around this time. We're just gonna go for the goal. No messing around. Although I will get these. Look at this. Look at this cheap nonsense. Uh, am I going the right way? Still shoot. Yeah, get fucked. You know, I probably shouldn't even pick those up anymore. Because all that's going to happen is I'm just going to keep redoing the same flying levels again and again and again. Yeah, I'm not even going to bother with that. Shake. <sighs> that was a journey. Right back to the first one again. I'm just gonna kill myself. <laughs> Come here. Good. Stardust Cavern 6. What is with these levels in their order? You, come. fucked up. I need to get the pot down there first. What a simple mistake to fuck up a whole level. <laughs> God. This game does not care. You gotta be ready to solve it perfectly. Quack.
God, platforms. Oh my god, they're <laughs> they're moving so quickly. I didn't mean to pick that up. I wonder how many levels there actually are. Uh well I fell. Projectile bubbles. Oh yeah, you can jump on guys. I always forget that. There we are. Yeah, Bubble is the kid. Squeak is the blue guy. I know. You would think that Bubble would be the blue guy, because he shoots bubbles, but nope. Should I actually try to beat these? I don't know. I'll leave it up to you guys. Because if I just get game over, we're just going to go back to the beginning. I do want to try to see the end of the game, if possible. Place your votes now. The solution is to not get a game over. You troll. I think I'm gonna avoid. So I'm not planning on making this a super long stream today. In fact, I'm actually kind of curious to see how far I can get in three hours, and then I might just call it a night. Because there are some things I would like to do. That I really haven't <clears throat> been able to give myself the opportunity to do. Wow, that was cool. I just got hit in the face with my own star. I mean, half of these levels are trial and error. It's like you have to fuck up once or twice to get to the solution, so... What are you doing? Stop. Here, jump up here. There you go. Oh, I see. I see, I see. Here. Here. Oh. Alright then. Uh. Well, he's gone. He is up there now. And I have a jar. And I don't know what to do with the jar. But ah. Ran into him excellently. He had a very tight turning pattern. Alright, come here. Squeak is to Bubbles, like Hobbs is to Calvin. You know, I kind of see a Calvin and Hobbs thing going on here, now that I look at them. 
They have very similar artistic features. Th these penguins can suck a dick. I love this. Macau said, somebody please give me a TLDR of the story. M Mick says, monkey found in dirty clothes needs to help save friends. <laughs> Macau says, good enough. <laughs> I mean, yeah. That's the story. And there's a black hole in a sock. That was, that was one part of it. Yes, they do bat the stars back at you if you shoot them in the face. The gems are guiding me, I think. Mm, maybe? Oh, no, there's water. There's a gumball machine down here. What good's that gonna do? They're following the Rayman approach, where they put the uh, the little the little collectibles to form a path. It's been one of the best game design choices I've ever seen in a game. Okay, well I have a jar now, so what do I do with the jar? I need to get up to him, if I can. Fuck that fuck. Oh, we're saving Squeak's friends from the, uh, the evil cat of nine tails. Who is a- who is in fact a cat. That much has been established for us. We even saw him earlier in one of the shoot 'em up levels. Okay, seriously, what the fuck am I even doing? <laughs> the water is just too far gone now. Oh, I feel like a jerk off. Yeah, the water's way too high now. RIP! Okay, I'm not going to shoot him up there this time. I think that may have been my first mistake. Go down here. Yes, collect the gems for me, please. Oh, I see. I see. 
Okay, now it's making a little more sense. So I guess there's no way to recover them if you shoot them up here. Which kind of blows. There, there probably is a way, it's just that I'm too stupid to see it. Here. Let's just, let's just look. Because I know the water is too far gone for me to get to the bubble machine again. Oh yeah, these are the little rescue pods that you get the Squeak's friends from. See? There they go. So I guess the way to get back to them is to use that pot. And then I have to basically ride him up here. Okay, I see. I think I see the solution. Um, yeah, I could fall down there and catch him. Great. <laughs> All right. I wonder how many levels there actually are. Alright, you wait here. I'm gonna go put that jar in place. Alright. We're good. <coughs> Come with me. Squeak, please. So that's the thing that just happened. Hmm. Bust a move, let's go. Fucking stop doing that! Fucking stop it! <laughs> you drive me crazy, Squeak! You're tearing me apart, Lisa! Thank God. Just in time. It seems like there may be multiple solutions to this level, but, um... I'm gonna do this one. Because it works for me. Yay! Did it. I didn't collect any extra things. It doesn't matter. <coughs> <coughs> ba 
password! Back to the diamond foundry. <laughs> Move on next level. Hmm. Come on. That was weird. The game like started for a second. Did you hear that? Um. Oh dear. Fine mess this is. It's fine. I don't even know if I need this, but I'm taking it anyways. Squeak! No, come on. God, that would have sucked. Oh god. Shake! Guess we're done here? I hope. Oh. Yep. Bonk. These robots kind of suck too. Yeah, this game's actually pretty fun! I think now I need the gumball machine. Oh god. Here comes our old friend Water. Uh, hurry. the goal. Um, shit. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Can 
Can I get up there? Without Squeak? Oh, fuck. I might need Squeak for this. Oh. What are you doing? You bald headed twat! Roundy, orangey headed twat. Bald, round, orangey head. Got a head like a fucking orange. Nah. I was I was spooked. Spooked by the the robot. <laughs> it's okay. I'm fine. Very clever little game. I like it. Not a whole lot of these, like, co-op puzzlers out there. Well, not like co-op, but you know what I mean. Like, partner puzzle games. If that makes sense. Actually, yeah, he can jump up here. Perfect. Let's hurry, though. I don't think we have much time. Oh, no. No. Oh, you dick. Fuck, come on. Please! Okay, let's hurry. Come on, come on, come on. Get, get on! What are you doing? Carl Pilkington is bold. Carl Pilkington has got a head like a fucking orange. Right. <laughs> Good. That water is already rising, by the way. Just thought I'd point that out. the power-ups. Let's just go. And you're dead. Yep. You're dead. Oh. I guess I could have done that, huh? I'm just gonna grab what I can and just keep going. Um. Okay, we both drowned. the switch oh he can't get up here can he oh squeak god bless you you try so hard you and your stupid swimming goggles 
I, I don't know what else those could be. Yeah, we're not getting that, are we? Wow. This level. Um. Game? Hello? Game? Um. There's a. Uh... There's no game here, guys. <laughs> the game's soft locked. Well then. <laughs> That's unfortunate. And by unfortunate, that means that's fucking bullshit! <sighs> well. <laughs> I, uh, I think we're done for now. <laughs> I think I'm done. Having the game crash on you ain't no good. So you all got to see a little bit of the game. I hope you enjoyed it. And we will revisit this someday. I do have a collection of unfinished business games that we need to get to. One of these days. Uh, probably before I start getting into long series games like Shining Force or Fantasy Star. Um, we'll do some unfinished business streams. Games like Quackshot, uh, Dynamite Heady, even Echo the Dolphin will do the machine level. So, we got some unfinished business to take care of. Maybe we can start doing that next week. Because I would like to go back to some of those games. And this is now on the list. <laughs> so, when I have time, which is never, I'll uh, see if I can try to beat the game myself in my downtime. That way I can run through it all in one go for you guys. So, with that being said, I'm going to get going, and I hope you all have a great night. Thanks for watching.